to my channel. As you just saw, I am going to be doing my Easter basket haul today. These are one of my most favorite videos to film or to talk about because I love Easter and I love buying my kids stuff. It might seem like I go a little overboard for Easter, but yeah, like I said, I just enjoy buying my kids stuff and my daughters, Mackenzie and Casey, have December birthdays. So this is really the only other time of the year besides December where they actually get gifts. So I kind of like to do a lot for them because every other month of the year they don't really get anything unless they need something. So yeah, I have everything right here in my bed. I just showed you what it looked like all put together. Um, but now I'm going to show you individually what I have in each basket. I will link as much as I can down below in the description box for you guys. But Easter is coming up quickly, so I don't know if you'll be able to get everything, but yeah, just in case. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, let's start with Mason's Easter basket. I picked out just this wire basket because I wanted something that would fit into their rooms that they could use um, instead of just a generic Easter basket. So this one is really boyish, and I thought it would look really good in his room. I also got these signs. Um, well, I guess they're not signs. They're like little name tags that say their name. These are from Chalk Designs by me. I found her shop on Instagram, and I really just love these because they could be used for anything. They could be used for stockings or birthday parties or anything, so we can save these um, to use them all the time. So I have that tied on there. And, okay, I'm going to set this down and show you everything that's inside. Okay, first I have this big long thing sticking out, and it's a bat with a ball. Um, I wanted to get him a tea, but I just thought that was a little too much to go in an Easter basket. So I got this instead. This is really my first year buying boy toys. Um, Mason's almost three, but really so far he's only had like baby toys, not specific like boy items. So now is like the first time I'm like buying this stuff. I had no idea what to do in the boy aisle. I'm like, Cody, help me out. Like, I don't know what to get Mason. So yeah, Cody picked out a lot of his stuff. But yep, baseball and bat. Then we got this little Nerf gun. It just has two things, but I was going to get a bigger one, but I just, I don't think he's ready for that. So just a little mini. And then another gun. This was a dollar. It's just a water gun. This is a replay recycled cup. These are the only sippy cups my kids use. They love these. And I thought this one was super cute because it looks like a little fireman helmet. So I put that in there. These are literally the best sippy cups you will ever have. I recommend them to any new mom or anyone who has toddlers. They are the best. They really are spill proof. This little thing was in the Target dollar section and it's just a mix and match puzzle. Yeah, it was only $3 in the dollar section. I got him some crayons, chalk. I feel like everyone puts chalk in Easter baskets, right? Okay, this is from my Etsy shop. This is a little Blippi um, peg doll, and Mason loves Blippi. He's a YouTube character. So I made that, and I put that in his basket. And just for you guys who are watching this video right now, um, you can get 15% off of your order in my Etsy shop, which is linked down below, if you use the code Surprise Easter. So yeah, I'm not going to post that anywhere else, it's just for you guys who are watching my vlog. Um, but yeah, hurry up and get your orders in before Easter. I got some bath drops. These just like make your bath water different colors. I'm sure it will stain my tub and I'll enjoy cleaning that. And then in this little egg, I put, um, they're all going to fall out. Just little finger puppets that look like this. They really like that kind of weird stuff. I got these in the Target dollar section. So yeah, I just opened the bag and I stuffed them into this egg. And then this I got off Amazon and it's um, a set of 60 little tiny dinosaurs that look like this. I wanted to get this because he has a dinosaur bedroom and I got a glass jar that's going to sit on his dresser and I thought these would look so cute in the glass jar with his dinosaur themed room. I mean obviously he can still play with them but when he's not playing with them they'll just be sitting on his dresser and I thought that was super cute and this was like not very expensive. Bubbles. And then for the toddlers I didn't get much candy. I just got them a chocolate bunny and then some Reese's Pieces. Okay that was everything for Mason. Now I'm going to show you all of Harper's stuff. 
and her basket's a little smaller so it looks like I overfilled hers but it's just because her basket's smaller so here is what her basket looks like her bedroom is gonna have a lot of um, ballerina and pink in it because she loves ballerinas and tutus so this basket from Target was so perfect for her she also has the name sign right there and yeah I'm gonna show you everything that's in here Okay, right on the outside, I have a Spriss Pals bow clipped on there. I always like to clip on the bows because I think it just looks presentation-wise cute. Um, but also from Spriss Pals, I have these snap clips because that is what she has been loving lately. Um, yeah, they're just little clips. Look like that on the back. But how cute are these colors? If this is your first Spriss Pals order, if you click the link down below and use Colt, code um soltrup 15 you can get 15 percent off your first order so definitely check her shop out she has so much cute stuff and then i also have an egg for her that just has the finger puppets inside as well i'm not going to take them all out and then from my etsy shop again you can use that code surprise easter for 15 percent off your order i have the jumbo peg dolls princesses so she has snow white moana and anna because these are her favorite three princesses she also has one of these mix and match puzzles but hers is a little different these are like career people i got her a dress i thought this was super cute it's from carter's um it just has a little rainbow on the bottom and it's spaghetti strapped has a little cross in the back like that Mason didn't need a bathing suit because he um, got some from my friend who passed some down on to me. So we didn't need any bathing suits for him this year. But hers is so cute. Um, this is from Style and Sophie Shop on Instagram. But I love the colors. It has a little open belly and then it ties around the neck. Love it. She also got some chalk. And she got bubbles. She also got a replay recycled cup, but this one is princess themed. She got crayons. This is from Target, and it's a little purse that looks like an ice cream cone. Harper's super girly and loves like necklaces and hats and just like anything girly. Um, so I know that she's gonna love this and bring it everywhere. I thought that was really cute. And then she picked this up one time in Target and didn't want to leave it, but I'm like, no, put it back. And I went back and got it for her. It's a ballerina, of course, so I know she's going to be so happy to see that. This is really cute. I got this from a shop, and now I can't think of the name of it. I'll, le I'll leave the link down below, but it's a little mini wand, and it's glittery at the top, and it has cute ribbons. Just a cute toy to play with. Super girly. Love that. And then the same stuff as Mason. She has the bath drops too. And then she got a chocolate bunny and Reese's. I had everything so neat in here and all organized. So now I'm going to have to redo all that. All right. I had to tie my hair up because I'm sweating. Anyways, I am going to show you Mackenzie and Casey's baskets together because... They are girl twins, so I always have to make sure I get the same exact things or else there's going to be a lot of fighting involved. Um, it's the same but different, so I'm going to show you it all together. First, these are going to be sitting outside of their baskets, but this is part of their new bedroom. They have this corner that we're going to turn into like a little reading nook, so I wanted to get some stuff for that, and I just decided to put it with their Easter baskets. So we have this circle fur rug. Um, this is going to go in the corner. I'm going to get some like toss pillows and stuff to go on here too, but I haven't grabbed those yet. But yeah, just a plain fur white rug. And then this is what's going to be hanging down from the ceiling in the corner. I don't know if it's kind of hard to tell because it's white, but this is just like a little canopy. What do they call it? A dip dye cana canopy. And it's white and it's like ombre pink at the bottom. So yeah, that is what the white rug is going to be like right there. So that is going to be for both of them. Here is what Casey's basket looks like. She has the silver one, again, with the name tag here. Then Mackenzie 
got the pink one, pink name tag. Okay, hanging on the outside, I have these clips on both. They are from Spruce Pals, that shop I told you about, where you can get 15% off with the code, the code SoulTrips15. Um, but they are glitter clips, and they're just like the alligator clips. So they just stick so nicely right in their hair. They're, they're kind of getting out of the bow phase, but these are still super girly and cute, with, but more like tween, more for tweens is what I'm trying to say. This came in, came in a set of four, and I just split them up. So, yeah, super cute. I love those. They each got a pair of sunglasses. This one has the kind of cat eye. This is a fun rainbow one. Then I got them some chokers. Like, anyone from the 90s remembers these. So funny. This was a, a pack, one pack, and I just split it up because they'll usually just share whatever they have. So, yeah, I just put some in both their baskets. I found a set of bracelets that I thought were really cute and girly and perfect for summertime. So I got them each one of those. They each got the same pair of shoes. These were from Walmart and they were pretty cheap. But look how cute they are. I love all the straps. I love the blush pink. Okay, these coloring books I got are kind of funny because I got them off Amazon and I thought that they were more, I didn't really pay attention, I guess, but I thought they were more for older kids. And then I got them, and Cody's like, are you serious? <laughs> like, are these for Harper and Mason? I'm like, whatever. The girls sometimes just like to randomly color, so this will be fine. Mackenzie likes cats, so I got this coloring book. Um, but yeah, it's kind of kiddish. I don't know why I, I don't know what was going through my mind. This one's pretty, pretty dang kiddish. <laughs> the unicorn one. Like, okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so yeah, whatever, I just still put them in there. And then with that, I got them some colored pencils. And then I got them some of these classic storybooks. This one is A Little Princess, which is, used to be one of my favorite movies. And the girls have actually watched this movie with me. And then The Secret Garden. Okay, these I just found today actually at Target, and they were in the clearance section for only $5. Um, so I thought these were, they always like want to have candles and stuff, and I'm just not ready to let them have candles in their room, or like anything that plugs in, I don't know. So these are just reed diffusers that can just sit on their dresser, no, no need to plug anything in or flames or anything. This one is Ivy Rose, and this one's Blue Jasmine. So I know, I know that they're going to like these. I each got them nail polish remover and then a nail polish. And then the rest is just candy. So I did the Reese's again. Um, I did chocolate bunnies. And then they got each a pack of gum. Starburst. And these Skittle eggs. All right, guys, that is everything I got for Easter. I know some people are going to comment and be like, whoa, that's way too much. Or some people might be like, that's not enough. I don't know. It just really depends on how you guys celebrate Easter. I like to spoil my kids on Easter, so that's just me. <laughs> don't forget to check out all the links down below. Check out the codes I left for certain items. Um, yeah, don't forget to use that Etsy code. It's special to this one single video that I filmed, so... Definitely use that one. And let me know down below what you got your kids this year that you're really excited to give them because I like to just know and be nosy. One more thing, and then I'll be quiet. Um, I, po I listed my other two Easter basket vlogs in the description box as well just so you guys can get more, more ideas if you have smaller kids like babies and toddlers. And, yeah, you can see what I bought my kids the past two years too. So... Alright, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!